deals of the 10th of the 10th, 2015. Uh, this is on Saturday instead of Friday, because usually I record these on Friday, put them out on Friday. But then there are loads more deals just announced on Saturday, and it's really annoying because they're not in the video. So I thought, do this on Saturday when there's been a lot more deals announced, and let's go straight in. Plugin Digital Publisher deal on GMG for all their racing titles. Every single title has 75% slash off the price, except from uh, World Rally championship to five because that's a new title but it does have a 10 percent off which is amazing for racers if you love racing games or just races in general bike racing just any type at least check out these deals there's loads of games one of them will interest you if you're a racing fan that's gmg again going back to gmg we've got civilization that they're doing a complete deal on Civilization series on ever on different iterations of the Civ series including Civ 5 and beyond earth with Civ 5 only being 4.99 five pounds Deal, and it also has deals on the two major expansions for Civ 5, God King, God and Kings, and Brave New World. Civ 5 is a good game, is an alright game I should say by itself, but with the expansion packs it becomes a great game, a must buy for people who love strategy or people who like fun in general. Telltale Publisher Weekend on Steam with every game at least 66% off, except from the new Minecraft game series which is 10% off for the pre-order. You've got games like Game of Thrones which is £7.82, The Wolf Among Us £4.71, The Walking Dead Season 1 £4.74 £4 and Season 2 at the same price. Of course if you know Telltale they have a certain formula in terms of gameplay which is very popular and very, very fun. If not very very fun uh very popular and very f and somewhat fun to play so if you enjoy that check it out do some research on those type of games and see for yourself if it's worth the pickup a 40 percent se steam sale on darkest dungeon an extremely fun and popular dungeon crawler which saw a lot of twitch and youtube coverage when it first released on early access much of that has died down now but a lot of the main reason people did that was because they're waiting for the full game not because the game's gotten worse just because they want the full game to come out and not ruin that experience for them the game is £8.99 on Steam and it's a definite worth if you love dungeon crawlers. This game is really fun, just like you get you get to you get so attached with all the people you're calling the dungeons with and they just die, they get pneumonia, they get all these crazy diseases and they just die off. But yeah, I'll let you play that. 75% Steam sale on Lego Batman 3 Beyond Gotham. A game which I honestly know nothing about and I can't really tell you about, but there's uh loads of very positive uh, user reviews on Steam, which is always a good sign to do some research and decide if this game's for you. Aliens for the Pe Alien vs Predator 2010, an oldie but a goodie. It's 75% off at only £2.49. If you're a fan of the franchise or fan of good games in general, then they're worth a pickup. Now, a warning, <laughs> because Aliens vs Predator is on sale for 75% off, but Alien colonial marines which is part of the aliens franchise sort of games but it's not tied in with aliens vs predator is also included in a bundle with aliens vs predator so you might be tempted to go and pick that up and i'm gonna save you the time and tell you stay the fuck away this game sucks this game is definitely one of the worst games of 2013 a definite must buy just buy aliens vs predator by itself it's not worth the cheap price of the bundle i'm not even gonna say that. it's not even worth it any more coverage just stay away from it i know there's steam refunds just stay the fuck away it's shit now it's talking about shit no i shouldn't say that origin uh, a service i found myself using more and more these days which i stayed away for for ages and i know loads of people still like i said leaves a bad taste in people's mouths it's just just the general poor reception but it's gotten a lot better and they're offering a 48 hour experience of titanfall all parts of the game are fully unlocked it's not like a beta and you only get to play some parts all parts of the game can fully unlock for 48 hours full access however because it is a multiplayer game and there's not a big user base right now the user base at launch was huge and for a few weeks was huge and then just sort of plummeted so matchmaking might be a little bit difficult might take you a while to get into a match also i feel just this is redundant for saying this if you unless you've been living under a rock or some sort of cave you would know the type um sorry battlefront is also beta for open beta for anyone to play on origin so if you want to check that out there you go only the multiplayer some parts of the game are, are just sort of like stashed away it's not for me but if you like shooters take a look at it pc gamer uh, offering a sort of unique service as they partner up with Bundle Stars to give you free Steam keys. This has been going on for four weeks, and I've been part. I've been doing it for the past two weeks, and I've picked up Eight Bit Boy, and now they're offering Bionic Dues. All you have to do to get these keys is follow them on Twitter, social media, like their Facebook page. Uh, this is PC Gamer and Bundle Stars. 
so you just got like the twitter page facebook page and the publisher or the person who developed the game's twitter's page just follow them and then you'll get the free steam key it works perfectly fine obviously i can't guarantee that these games will be amazing and they'll be for you i picked up 8-bit boy which was a very solid platform and quite fun retro platformer but it's an easy way to get literally free games so if you want to check that out the link will be in the description and so will be the link for everything else i have mentioned now onto some hardware we've got acer 24 inch tn 1080 monitor with vga and dvi for just 94 pound 97 at ccl bargain deal go check it out if you need a monitor if you need a second monitor or just you're looking for a new monitor at 24 inches from less than 100 pounds amazing pick this up Corsair Vengeance 8 gigabytes DDR3 2133 megahertz. I don't think that's how you're supposed to say it, but who cares? High profile RAM, only £38.67 on Amazon. This is just an exact sign of how cheap DDR3 RAM is getting nowadays. I mean, you can get these things at just crazy price. And this is a tw this is a 2133 megahertz. So this is just that's just amazing. Like I've got my 1866 megahertz um RAM for uh, it's 16 gigs, but it's still for 60 something, for 60 something pounds, which is DDR3 is just getting so cheap. And for this, I think like if you're looking for RAM, it's high profile RAM, so look at it to you how your PC, if you've got like a custom cooler or something, it might get in the way. Not a custom cooler, uh, a air cooler, which is quite high profile as well, it might get in the way. So look into that. But amazing, mm, just have a look at it. It's on Amazon, by the way. Sandisk 480 SSD at 99 pound. 98 at dabs.com with the voucher code which is shown in the page considering my 120 gigabyte ssd cost me 41 pound at this time at the time of purchase and this is a 480 gigabyte ssd which is four times the size of mine at only a little bit double the price that's an amazing deal it's on amazon it's on amazon i'll put that link in the description you also got a 128 gigabyte USB, USB 2.0 at £16.99. What can I say? You need a USB 128 gigabytes, 17 quid. Pick it up. There we go. And those are some of the best deals that I've found today. Again, I always say this. These, there's some more better deals. These are ones I thought were m worth mentioning. There are loads out there. If you want to find out more deals, I, will, I do tweet some out. So follow me on social media. Like the video if you liked it. Do whatever you want. Dislike it. But these are some of the best deals. Have a good day. Leave any deals you can find in the comments. Have a good day. Bye.